Hi everyone, this is WebOS Roundup. Today I'm going to be taking a look at Newsroom by Trilete Inc. This app costs $4.99 on the catalog. The goal of this app is to be your news source. It is an aggregator or an RSS reader. It is a very elegant one and one that I highly recommend and you'll see why here in a second. The first page here shows you all the sites that I have hooked up. Now you can add as many as you want. You can do this. Here's the featured list where they have a bunch of different uh, sites that they recommend. They can do a search where you can type in your favorite ones or you can type in the URL directly if you know it. One little nitpicky thing that I have is I wish this featured list was a little bit more robust. Some categories, the ability to have just a whole lot more would be good. Again, very nitpicky, not a big deal. Now here again is my sites. You can see the number here shows me the articles that I have not read yet. If you want, you can star articles and they'll be all hidden under here. If you want, here's, a, here's where our customization comes in. You can see that you can mark things as read by clicking or whether they stay unread, whether there's background updates, etc. Good customization there. Now when you're ready to click on something, click on that. See how it bounces a little bit. This app is all about polish and you'll see those little uh, add-ons that really make things shine I think. You can see here now I'm in what I call blurb view. I'm sure there's a better name for it somewhere but it basically allows you to see just enough of the app to get your uh, interest peaked. So if you find one that you really want to read about you can go into what I call read view which you shift the entire UI up and it goes into the entire article allows you to read things very easily, very cleanly. You can see everything moves very quickly. Over here we have a few buttons. We have the uh, source link right there. And if I click over here on this guy, it will actually send an email to your friend or family for about that article. So we got here, that's an image that I had clicked before. And now we are back in the app. So if you want, you can jump to the next site or the next article on the site. If you want to go back to the blurb view, you just slide it down. Now you can go over around here, and when you are ready to go back, you slide up and it shifts back to the initial view. Again, it's very elegant, it's very clean. It gets you to your articles very fast without a lot of unnecessary clicking. Um, it's been rare that I've actually had to go to an external site. Uh, you can see if you want to load an image or something, it will put it into the next page. Some uh, content providers don't give you the whole article, which is not Newsroom's fault, of course. Um, the only hesitation would be the price. $4.99 is a bit high on the scale of RSS feeders, but if you are a news head like me, then it's a small price to pay because it works so well. Um, if you're not, then you might want to stick with Google News or a cheaper uh, feed reader. However, I heartily recommend it, and if uh, you're anything like me, I would get it today. This has been WebOS Roundup. Please visit us at webosroundup.com. Thanks a lot. Bye-bye.